wants to see you. She wants to see your face. Yeah. <laughs> Light her up, baby. <laughs> Okay, the batteries. Oh, okay. How long do the batteries last for? You know what I'm coming in for, don't you? Yeah. I love your outfit. If you don't mind me interrupting, can I get a quick shot? Yeah, sure. Oh, hello. Hey. Oh, yes, yes, oh. that's the GoPro. Welcome back, guys, to another street pub. We are here in London, and it is sunny again. I'm very happy about that. More than three days in a row, so it's kind of feeling like a blessing. I know I go on about the weather, but you know what it means to me. So we are around, um, that is St. Bath Molyhue, something like that. Um, hospital, I'm holding up traffic in the road. Um, and we're kind of just going for a wee wander, following the light. Haven't necessarily got too much of a um, plan on where to go. Um, today I was thinking about heading down to more the water sort of way just because the weather is nice and we are going to have people out in the streets and um, they tend to go to more of those naturistic sort of areas because of the sun being out. But wow, look at the texture on this building. I don't know if you can really see it from here. Anyway, it's pretty cool. Um, Today, I've actually got the Fujifilm, um, pulled it out of the closet, um, X-T1, uh, it's been a while since I've used it, good little camera, um, I've got the 23mm on it today, which because it isn't full frame, it's going to be a 35 um, equivalent, and um, good camera in the sense that I used to use it um, as a travel camera also, um, when I go out and travel um, jobs, when I used to assist back in Australia and New York, so um, really cool compact and just easy to use so um having something like that around and about is kind of um handy to have something's going on there i don't know what but um yeah these cameras um i really enjoy them it's it's um mirrorless so you can see what exposure you actually have at the time and um <coughs> it's um compact so rather than having a big dslr um like my canon um, 5D Mark IV, which I do love as well. This is just a good camera to have about. Small size. Um, let me know what sort of cameras you guys are looking to test and sort of play with. Um, Dave and I, between us, have quite a few cameras um, laying about the house, so um, I should do some more pops on different cameras. So if you've got a particular one that you are eyeing up and sort of want to hear a review on, um, let me know. I know there's lots of reviews out there, but um, have you ever had a Kiwi review, the one that you were looking at? Anyway, rambling on. Let me rig up and um, we'll get more towards the waterfront. So, thanks for the feedback on the previous pod, guys. Um, it was really cool to hear your guys' thoughts on um, sort of the conflict on the streets and also just, you know, noticing how different I can be with the old... Um, when the weather is about, it really has made the most incredible difference for me. Okay, so, first of all, turn your camera on. Um, yeah, so, being out in the streets in this sort of weather has um, really just upped my spirits and not even just being out in the streets, just general life. It's, um, as I've said, you know, growing up in a lot of sunshine, it's sort of, um, impedes my personality when I don't get the energy fix from the sun so it's um a balance but we're getting there once the borders open up and Dave and I can start traveling again we will be out of London and um traveling sort of exploring areas that interest us as most people do and um we'll see what happens but Cool reflections on the building across. Where are we here? Criminal court. Looks like fun. So, just checking my exposure. What have we got? This lady masked up here. We'll grab a quick shot with the incredible background behind her. Thank you. God, it's been so long since I've used this camera. Where's our focus? But yeah. Cameras are always like riding a bike, I feel. You know, the more you, um, you never really forget how to use it. It just sometimes takes a wee bit to um, get to that point again. 
So we're gonna get this guy as he blows his smoke out. Yeah. Has a wee um, backlit from the sun. Yeah. Yep, yep, you're, you're all over it. Thank you, mate. Amazing, appreciate that. Yeah, no problem. Have a good day, Thanks. cheers. Don't even know how to bring out the playback. <laughs> so, <clears throat> looking at the playback there, I am at um, 1.4, shutter is at 4,000 and ISO is at 200, which I wouldn't like to be at 200, but I kind of have to be there because this yeah. camera um, runs at, there we go, runs at um, JPEG when you were doing a, uh, I might jump down there, when you're on, uh, wow, what a cool wide shot. Yeah, this camera, when you're at um, ISO 100, it will run at JPEG, which means you don't get the uh, raw files. So, let's see what we can get with this guy. So, I can open up here. I might go back to 1.4. So, he's doing a bit of welding down here. As long as I stay on the side of the barriers, it should be good. So, if he's going to bring out the flame again, it would be pretty sick, but we'll see. Yeah, <laughs> light her up, baby. <laughs> but, but hopefully not. <sighs> Funny. There we go. I'm just go above the barrier. Not bad. You get the, these guys hard at work as well. Not Thanks, yet. mate. Not yet. <laughs> Great face. Thanks, mate. Cheers. <laughs> um. Yeah, so just looking for something, point of difference. And just um, showing you guys how easy it is just to kind of get out there and get some shots, you know. Like, you don't have to um, plan too much or... Wow, the light down there is so good. Um, have a particular idea as such. You kind of just need to, um, in reality, just get out there, really. So we'll wait for this lady to walk past this entrance. Oh, no, maybe the man behind. Oh, no. Yes. So, you guys have every right to be out on the streets photographing. Um, it's up to the people whether or not they want to be in it. But um, you can snap a shot and there'd be no issues with that. Um, they may feel offended as such, but there is no reason why you can't photograph. So we're actually coming up to St. Paul's here. Oh. <laughs> Had to get it, yeah, nice. man. Thank you. <laughs> so good. Great smile on him. Good energy. It's amazing. Every camera just has a different sort of shutter feel to it, you know. Um, this Fuji one, as much as it is a great camera, I do like that delayed clicking sensation that you get with the Canon. Um, but they're all different, you know, like when I've shot on a phase one, you kind of can't beat the um, shutter experience on that, in my opinion. Everyone's entitled to their own opinions, but yeah. Wow. Guy. So he's gonna come right around to the front, I assume. Hi. How are you going? Hi, you got great eyes. Sorry? You got great eyes. Thank you very much. Yeah, it's alright. Where are you from? Uh, New Zealand. Oh, yeah. yeah. What are you up to? Changing the batteries. Oh okay. How long do the batteries last for? On these on maybe about five or six days. Oh that's not too bad. Yeah, it's kind of Sweet. Yeah, do they take a while to charge? Oh, it's just a um, standard battery, car battery. Same as car battery, yeah. Yeah, very good. Can I take a portrait of you? Just as you are, right there. <laughs> Get on you, mate. Uh, perfect. <laughs> Easy done. <All> Thank right. you. <laughs> wow, a few of them there. Anyway. So, 
Hobson Pools is a beautiful building to photograph. It can be difficult at times in the sense of highlights and lowlights. Depends what time of day you're actually um, able to get here and photograph. So I'm just closing down a bit. So the old 35, I have to back up a bit. Might just clip for the top and um, get the wrapping of the trees around as well. So it's kind of nice here. A quick frame. It's good. So as I've said before, when I'm out doing these pods, it's not necessarily me aiming to get the best street photography ever as such. It's kind of um, just location scouting and for you guys to um, sort of engage and see how easy it can be to get the old banger so I'm just checking it's been a while just want to make sure the there it is um, instead of a single shot I'm gonna get some pigeon bangers hopefully and just going to multi shot here where my pigeons go they're lingering around the food let's get these guys how you going <laughs> Just getting a shot while I'm at it. Thanks, guys. <laughs> All right, so if you know me, I do love a good pigeon banger, but what we want to do is get them out in the sun. And I might get these ones here. So, okay, shutter didn't go off then. Just checking. It will be more because of. No, I didn't go to, I went to double exposure, so let's just, yeah, there we go. As I said, it's been a long while. So I'm going to trip this pigeon. All right, so, got it nice and close there. Wow. Last shot was bang on, but the, um, the rest of them kind of cut it off so you've got to get used to the angles of my shots but how are we going you, you know what i'm coming in for don't you yeah. i love your outfit if you don't mind me interrupting can i get a quick shot yeah sure awesome okay um we're at a sick location let's pop you in the sun yeah come along for the ride <laughs> um okay stop right there because what i'm going to do is shoot into the darkness so you're really going to pop Oh my god, it's so good. What would you call your style? I have no idea. What's your name? Eva. Eva, there we go, it's an Eva style. All right, let me pop in here. Amazing. Okay, Eva, look up to the sun for me. That's great. Bring your chin around to me a little bit more. That's it. And shoulders back to me. Great. Oh, let's take it off that setting and maybe just touch the glasses with, yeah, that's great. Nice soft smile in there. It's great. And what's your name? Uh, Lucinda. Lucinda. Okay, tell Lucinda how amazing the weather is today. It's great weather. <laughs> there we go, got that smile in there. Some nice shots. So Lovely. there's no filter in there, but I'll send these over to you if you like. Oh, sure. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, actually, it's probably easier. I'll give you a sticker. <laughs> Um, if you hit me up on Instagram cool. and then um, just tell me St. Paul's um, and Eva and then I'll get them over to you. Okay? Thank you, Thank you so much. Enjoy your day. <laughs> Cheers. What an outfit. Um, all right. Okay, I'm just going to open up again for of these guys. Maybe not. Carry on. So, as you can sort of tell from that experience there, it's more about just um, really putting yourself out there and just saying hi to people. Yeah. How are you going? Yeah, okay. Oh, I'm loving this fella here. He's got a matching coat and everything. And you little lassie. Hey. <laughs> oh. Yeah, he wants to be like more, more, more. <laughs> really? <laughs> So good, you look great as well. <laughs> oh, hello. Hey, 
Oh yes, yes, oh. that's the GoPro. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wonderful. Do you get out and walk them daily? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah? They're coming most of the time to the, the, the center poles. So. Oh, nice. That's yeah. good. Yeah, it's a good day for it. I'm glad it's warming up for you. And then, but it's the, you know, it's a rainy day. Yeah. It's a snowy day. <laughs> <laughs> well, at least they get you out, you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, Fresh yeah. air is always good. Yeah. Oh, wonderful. <laughs> wonderful. Oh, you, you're full of cuddles, aren't you? You might want to see this, the, the fox. We just saw Oh, it. really? <laughs> oh, wow. In St. Paul's Gardens? Run to the, to the park side, so. Oh, wow. I'll have to go have a look. Yeah, they look. That's the, the fox saw us, then it's like ran away. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'll yeah, let yeah. you continue. Thank you. Oh. All right. Oh, cute little doggies. Focus isn't quite there, but oh, that's all right. So. Oh, all right, guys. Might finish this one up here, just so that uh, you guys can sort of gauge what um, interactions I sort of generally get when we're out and about. It's um, not necessarily for me. It's not about heading out and sort of getting a particular shot that I've got in mind. Sometimes I may have that idea in mind, but. It's more about just sort of getting out, experiencing the streets and going with the flow of it. Like when you are in a flow state on the streets, you can see sort of the interactions that you have. And when your energy level is higher, it just makes it um, just easier to approach people and sort of gauge those shots. How are you, man? <laughs> and um, it makes it worthwhile, you know, it sort of puts you outside of your comfort zone and in a place where you can um, push yourself to excel and grow a little bit more and that's what life should be all about and it's what photography is about as well you know just grabbing your camera um, trying different settings and getting out there so <clears throat> with trying those different settings try different cameras as well so as I said guys um, let me know what sort of cameras you are looking to try test and that sort of thing and um, I'll do my best to either we have it in the house or we sort of have it around um, at a place that's available so let me know what cameras you want to test um, talk about what lenses you want to test Dave and I have got basically the full kit range in um, Canon and Sigma and adapters and all that sort of stuff so um, plenty around and guys be sure to check out the presets because if you are new to photography presets are the way to go in order to um, sort of get your photos to the next level it sort of adds some grading to it which allows um, just more of a professional look so jump on to there's a link in my banner which will take you to the um, uh, where you can get the uh, presets Shopify forever seen. All right, guys, enjoy, enjoy that sunshine and St. Paul's, and um, we'll catch you on the next one. All right, see ya, bye.